Hello, everybody, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. I am Rufal, playing this game for you. Woo! Ah, we still return to our wooden sword. Hooray! All right. Let's go back out and, uh... Do stuff with the children. Because after all, it's our day off, so naturally it's going to be extremely busy. Probably because kids. Hey there. Yeah, I got the slingshot. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Oh, let's see here. Take that. <laughs> Does make it easier to deal with the scarecrows. Piece of cake. Oh, thanks. <laughs> oh, all right. I don't know about you going after monkeys, but yeah, I'll teach you how to use a sword. That move. Can you be more specific? Ah. Yeah, just swing it. Like so. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's it. Yeah, yeah. What other move? You sound creepy when you put it like that. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Other move. <laughs> like so. <laughs> Mallow wasn't looking too impressed, at least not until the end. Uh, Tello, you really need to listen. <laughs> Huh? Hey, monkey! Oh! Ah, this doesn't seem like it'll go well. Come on, Epona. Catch up with the kids. Beth, where are the boys? That well, sounds like them. Yeah. Oh. Hey, Mello. Right. Hey, yeah. Hey, yeah. Hello. Get back here. Yeah. Hey 
Tell you what, that kid's got some legs on him. Dark ahead. Party's interested in going in forage. Come this way first. Well, that's what Apona was getting excited about. But we do actually need to come by this way first. Hello, sir. Yes? Whoa, an Adordian. Hey, guy. Listen, not sure you, sh sure you should be wandering around these woods without a lantern. That's because daylight doesn't mean it's safe. There's tons of caves and dank spots. That's around here they get pretty dark, even during the middle of the day. Here, go on, guy. Take this. Oh, thanks. See, I sell lantern oil here. I'm trying to drum up sales by giving away free lanterns. It's a business tactic, guy. Oh, all right then. See, as long as you've got oil to fuel your lantern, you can let your way and set fire to stuff. They're the best. Come on, guy, try setting fire under that big pot. Think so? That's right, it's on fire. Yeah, you just keep using that lantern anytime if you'll need. Runs out of oil, come back and see me get refilled. Oh, no thanks. You get some used to have your lantern there for sure. Right, right. Gotta catch up with Tello. Hmm. Found a stick. We don't technically need the lantern to navigate the to navigate this this place, but uh, we do actually need it to progress. So yeah, not for the light, for the fire. Wait with you. Yes. I can pass the spider webs without uh, without the fire. For some reason, in the Wii and GameCube versions of, of the game, picking up, uh, picking up rupees after saving will give you the text on what they are again.
Back up, punk. You too. Hello. Strike the back down, too. Yay! Had to be introduced to my one of my least favorite parts of this game. Yeah, the pieces of heart. They aren't 25% of a heart, they are 20, so we need five of them. Oh well. That key was the primary thing we went that way for. Sorry, sir, no autographs. I will take your lunch money, though. You need to work on your sales pitch, bird. Box, open. Thank you. Oh, there he is. Oi! You okay? Duck. Uh, you okay? Ah, I was wondering how you ended up together. Hmm? Uh... No, I don't think he needs to hear about this. 
Yeah, yeah, I think you learned your lesson. <laughs> You're safe now. Go on home. Ufu! Huh? Oh, uh, hey, Russell. My son told me Talo disappeared into the woods and has not returned. Came as soon as I heard. It looks like you brought him home already. Apologize. Such a task should not fall to you. Tell me, you noticed how strange the, this wood seems lately? I feel uneasy about what may lie in wait. Anyway, that was finally the day. You'd be departing for Hyrule. I think it's a, a good thing I've given this task to you. <laughs> good luck. Return safely. If you're lucky, you may even get to meet Princess Zelda. <laughs> Oh, back to the dreary bliss of work. So much more relaxing than the day off. Hey! Oh, hey, Fano. What's up, dude? Uh oh, it's time for you to get going, eh? How about we finish up early today, bud? All right then. <laughs> There's a good girl. Hey! Ah, right, let's get started. on you. Hey, you! Point it the wrong way. No, no, no. Go that way. You! That way. Get in there, you. Woo, boy, but y'all can heard. Well, that about wraps her up for today. How about y'all head on over to the mayor's place? Yeah, something we need to get going on this. for the day. Oh, nice work. The royal gift Russell told you about is ready, so you should get ready for your trip to Hyrule Castle. Now, the royal family requested this gift specifically, so it's real special. It'd be bad if the representative of Ordon were to be late for such an occasion. You get me, lad? I gotcha. Huh? What's up? <laughs> I wasn't jumping fences! Just the gate to get out! <laughs> no, no, Ilya. No need to get... Hey, 
here. I was out of part of the gift to be delivered inside. Oh, this won't do. She's got a sticker nose and everything, doesn't she? Hmm, what's a father to do? There's no way he'll be able to deliver our town's gift without a pona. Hey! What? Oh, I can't leave you alone for a second, can I, Fado? <coughs> Down, go! Sorry to be putting you through this, but I'm gonna go and figure out what you're gonna do about a pona. Head up to where he is and see if she won't give the horse back. Oh boy. Huh. Hey, Russell. Hey. The time has come. Well, at least he just interested you in one serious sword lesson once you return from Hyrule. You have talent with a blade. If you were to get proper instruction, I bet you'd be a very skilled swordsman. Do let me know once you return. I want you to give it some serious consideration. Yeah, yeah. An idea for how I can get a puna back from Ilya. <laughs> Alright. Out there and for the bear today. Must be nice going on errands. He stuck in the store again today. Well, I gotta get anywhere by sticking around town. She went to the spring, huh? Oh, hey, Colin. Yeah, yeah. They don't? Are they picking on you again? How's it going, Beth? Hi. Yeah, that's the plan. Alright, I'll come back with stories. Hey, boys! Ah. Oh, you have? <laughs> uh, if you say so. Mello, why did you get scolded? Hmm. <laughs> oh, you dropped your toy one. Oh, here you go. And the boys have been distracted. Now, oh, not to worry, Colin. It's kind of a yeah. It is kind of a shame that they're uh, picking on you for doing the responsible thing, but. Hmm. Uh, you might want to, you might want to uh, uh learn to like a sword then. <laughs> That I can do.
Huh? Great. Will you just tell me how you did catch the monkey? Yeah, keep practicing, boys. Okay. I can steal my horse back from the lady. It... Oh. Hey, Colin. What do I do? All right. Gosh, the horse gets a scrape on her knee, and sudden, and suddenly, I'm the I'm the greatest villain that's ever er, assaulted Orden. Hi, Apona. Oh, <laughs> well, she knows the hand that feeds her. Oh, thank you for your permission. Hmm? What? All right, I'll be careful. <laughs> what the? Oh. Not get stepped on and all that. Huh? Wait. Where is everyone? Where's Apona? Where's Where's Colin and Ilya? No! 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 Whoa! What? What is that? Where'd that come from? Well, not sure how this can get any worse. Or better, depending on viewpoint. Let go of me, you! Ow! What is this place? What is this feeling? Well, that happened. As I'm being dragged off to become lunch, uh, I guess we'll leave it there.
Until next time. Later. <laughs>